Welcome to this webinar on our Bachelor of Arts. A reminder that we'll be running live Q&A sessions throughout Open Day alongside our online chat service. You can find the Q&A schedule on our Open Day homepage, or alternatively, you can contact us via any of the communication channels listed in the final slide. My name is Ray Godfrey. I'm part of the Future Students team and I'll be your webinar host for this event. Joining me today is Sue Yell. Sue is a senior lecturer in the Bachelor of Arts and also joining us is one of our current arts students, Marley Burke. Now, before we commence the session, I'd like to begin by saying that Federation University Australia acknowledges the custodians of the lands and waters where our campuses are located, and we recognise their continuing responsibilities to care for country at these sites of teaching and learning. We pay our respects to Elders past and present um, and extend our respects to all Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander First Nations people. Now I'd like to introduce Sue Yell to you. Sue is a senior lecturer within the Bachelor of Arts and she's going to give us an overview of the program. Thanks, Sue. Why study a Bachelor of Arts at Federation University? Well, the Federation University BA is a degree for life. It's designed to prepare our graduates to be future leaders and shapers of society. I've got a question for you. How many of our last eight prime ministers do you think completed a BA? Well, there were four, Bob Hawke, Kevin Rudd, Julia Gillard and Malcolm Turnbull. And we can add, uh, we can add Tony Abbott who completed a Master of Arts. The knowledge and skills you'll develop will mean you can contribute to positive change in the world, whether that's in your hometown or on a global level. In the Fed Uni BA, you will develop the critical skills, knowledge and perspectives needed to tackle the big questions and issues of our contemporary world. These would include ideas about ourselves and our identity, who we are, how we define ourselves, our relationship to society, what it means to live well as a member of our society, whether that's at a local, national or global level. The changes and challenges in our societies over time and the contemporary issues that we're confronting, whether that's to do with the environment, gender and sexuality, such as the Me Too movement, Indigenous rights, issues and tensions around immigration, dealing with war and conflict, who controls the media and the information that we, we get. Another important area that we tackle in the BA is what is knowledge and truth? How do we know what we know or think we know? And this is so important in the contemporary world as, we're, as we deal with things like fake news. So we need to learn how to separate fact from fiction. A lot of people wonder uh, what kind of career they could, could uh, end up working in after graduating from a BA. And that's always a hard question to answer just because there are so many different careers that you can become qualified for um, as a graduate with a, with a Bachelor of Arts. So for example, you could work in the government and public service um, in the role such as a res research or policy officer. You could work in museums and public records, for example, as a curator. You could become a professional writer or editor. Your passion may be for educating others. With a Bachelor of Arts, you could work in student support and tutoring, or you could add a master's qualification in teaching and become a teacher specialist in, in a discipline that you love, for example, literature and English. You could work in media and communications as a media relations officer or a social media marketing officer. You might want to work in social research as a consultant or become a community development officer. These are just a few of the many possibilities. A BA gives you a competitive edge. 
VA graduates are recognised by employers as all-rounders who can readily adapt to new challenges and who are flexible and innovative employees. As a Fed Uni BA, you'll develop skills that are highly sought by organisations in our rapidly changing world. Employers are telling us that they need holistic and critical thinkers, strategists, problem solvers and high level communicators. From a BA, you'll gain skills of critical and creative thinking, problem solving, research and analysis, and the ability to work collaboratively in teams. You'll have a highly developed ethical understanding, excellent oral and written communication skills, and the ability to find and sift through information rapidly. There are many majors and areas of specialisation that you can study in the BA uh, at Fed Uni. The key with a BA is always follow your passions and strengths. You'll get to specialise in a discipline you love while honing transferable skills. The Fed Uni BA offers majors in history, Indigenous studies, literature, media and screen studies, sociology and writing. Minor, minor areas of study are also available in criminal justice, community and human services and education studies. And you can take electives from many other fields such as the creative arts or marketing. Some careers and positions may seek a graduate in a specific discipline area such as history or media. Other employers will be regarding your degree as evidence that you have transferable skills and these demonstrate you can research and problem solve across various fields of knowledge. So let's take a look at the disciplines that we offer. In history, you can study areas including Australian history, Indigenous history, war and peace, how to research, write and teach history, gender and sexuality over time in history, Australia and the Asia Pacific, and philosophy in history. In Indigenous studies, you can study First Nations perspectives, Indigenous history, Indigenous societies, the health and diversity of First Australians, and Indigenous human rights. In literature, your studies will include drama, poetry, historical aspects of literature, contemporary fiction, children's literature, Australian literature, a range of literary genres, including horror and sci-fi, and literary adaptations, including from novel to screen. In media and screen studies, you can study Australian screen texts and industries, Asian cinema, the mainstream Hollywood film cultures and alternative cinema, screen genres, adaptations, the way media represents the world. You can investigate the relationship between technologies, power and politics, and the question of freedom and control in the media. To what extent are we free to choose and to what extent does the media control what we see, hear and know? In sociology, you learn to look at the world through the lens, through a sociological lens in the, in the sociological imagination. You'll study ideologies, race and ethnicity, families and relationships, genders, sexes and sexualities, the sociology of deviance, the sociology of sport, indigenous societies, and technologies, power and politics which have a social impact as well as a technological impact. Another popular discipline that we offer is writing. Writing introduces you to the skills of story, storytelling. You can learn and specialise in poetry or non-fiction, particularly creative non-fiction. You can learn 
how to write in, in a number of advanced modes and genres, digital writing, and experimental forms of writing. Fed Uni is rated number one for student support, and in the BA, you'll be taught by staff who are passionate about their discipline. For example, if you study writing, you'll be taught by academics who are published writers. If you study history, you'll be taught by academics who engage in community history. We'd love to meet you, so if you're passionate about the humanities and social sciences, come and study a BA with us. Thanks, Sue. Our second speaker is Marley Burke. Marley is currently studying the Bachelor of Arts and she's going to tell us a little bit about some of her experiences. Over to you, Marley. Hi, my name is Marley and I'm a third year Bachelor of Arts student doing a double major in literature and media. The Bachelor of Arts appealed to me for just this reason. I could pursue two of my deepest passions without having to choose one over the other. The diversity and range of the Bachelor of Arts has also allowed me the opportunity to explore other interests, such as creative writing and social welfare. The ability to experience other areas of the Bachelor of Arts has been invaluable and has allowed me the freedom to explore options that I may have otherwise never considered before settling my focus on literature and media. The Bachelor of Arts is not performing arts. Rather, with my majors, it allows me to explore and study the complexity and nuance of the written word and analyse and critique the use of visual technique in film and television. My Bachelor of Arts experience has opened me to a world of literature and film that I otherwise may have never considered, and each semester brings with it such a variety of texts, themes, techniques and challenges. I have studied novels considered to be amongst the first ever written, and novels that have challenged the very way in which I read. I have studied films from all over the world, analysing style, technique, and the way in which countries use film as a means of creating national identity. Throughout all my studies, whilst I have been pursuing my passions, I have also been learning skills that transcend my classroom experience. In analysing words and visuals, and digging for the deeper meaning, I have also been learning how to think critically and problem solve, both valuable workplace skills. I have had to consider the viewpoints of multiple characters, authors and directors, and therefore have developed a way of looking at situations from different perspectives. I can research, reference, support my own ideas with others, and present my thoughts and opinions in a logical manner because of the experience I have gained through my time in the Bachelor of Arts. These are some of the many transferable skills I will carry with me into the workplace. The Bachelor of Arts is fantastic because it opens up a world of possibility when it comes to careers. Currently, I have hopes of pursuing either a career in teaching, editing, or a government-based job. Whilst all three of these careers are so wildly different, the Bachelor of Arts has prepared me for each and every one, from the knowledge I have gained about literature and media to the transferable skills that I have developed. The Bachelor of Arts has also led to opportunities in other areas of university life. It was through the Bachelor of Arts and my strong relationships with fellow students and my lecturers that I was able to get the position as student representative on the School of Arts board a role that allows me to share a student voice with staff. From here, this role allowed me to get a position on the Student Senate, and from there I have had the great honour of becoming the Chair of the Senate. These roles have helped me to further develop my transferable skills whilst allowing me to learn even more, such as skills in leadership. My learning is greatly benefited by the smaller teams that we work in and the smaller classrooms that we learn in, and this is why studying rural has been so beneficial for me. Without these small settings, I may never have had the opportunity to build such rapport with fellow students and staff, which enabled me to further my reach within the university. 
I cannot recommend the Bachelor of Arts enough. It is flexible and easily tailored to your passions. It allows for a very diverse learning experience and ensures that you are ready for any job you could hope for. The small classroom settings are ideal and the Bachelor of Arts allows you opportunities all over to learn about yourself and others, easily making up some of the best, most challenging and equally the most rewarding years of your life. Thank you for listening to my Bachelor of Arts experience. I cannot wait to see what you do with yours. Thanks for tuning into our Bachelor of Arts webinar today. Don't forget about our live Q&A sessions and please just don't hesitate to contact us if you have any questions.